Praise is expressing greatness. Praise is expressing the beauty and, and excellence of something we call wonderful. His name is Wonderful Counselor. And when we praise God, we are praising his greatness, his beauty, and his excellence. You want to tell somebody it's time to praise God. Sometimes they look and act funny when people praise God. But the truth of the matter is, you don't know what I've been through. You don't know why sometimes every now and then I have to run around. Every now and then I have to yell a little loud. Not because God don't hear me, but because it's my way of giving thanksgiving unto a God who has never failed me yet. As a matter of fact, it's my way of giving thanksgiving to a God that loved me even when I was in sin. He loved me there. As a matter of fact, it's my way of giving praise to a God who knew I was messed up and jacked up. He didn't leave me, but instead, he picked me up and turned me around and he, he placed my feet on me. Calm down, Christian. It's too soon. It's too soon. You know, and I made up in my mind that no matter where my feet may trot, I got to take Jesus with me. And every now and then, we can't take Jesus riding with us for granted. Every now and then, you ought to invite him to tag along with you. Walk into the mailbox. You ought to say, come on, Jesus, and walk with me to the mailbox. Uh, walking through your job, you ought to say, Jesus, come on, walk with me down the hallways of my job, because he wants to feel welcome in your life. Uh, he wants to feel worthy in your life. Uh, he wants to feel honored in your life. Uh, I told you the Bible said that everything that have breath If you want to praise to categorize our life, the psalmist wants us to understand the second nugget I want to share with you is why you should praise. Verse number two says, praise him for his mighty acts. Praise yes. him according to his excellent greatness. Yes. Think your way through the psalms and you will be reminded of some of the greatest things that you know it without a shadow of a doubt that it was nobody but God who done it in your life. It wasn't because of the folks that you knew. It wasn't because of the people that you called. It was only because God had mercy on you. It was because favor that rested over your life allowed doors to be opened that nobody could open doors for you. Despite how many times they closed the door, favor said the door shall be open. Favor said the money shall be yours.
Get out of the way. 